I guess we set the Mithra. Oh, wait, we got game if I summon double lava golem. We got game, right? Yeah, yeah, we got game. That's 500, 500,000. Ooh. Ooh. Shiranui. Getting handed. Come on, come on. And Vassal. Monster locked down. The zone is locked. It's locked, bro. It's locked. Double lava golem. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. 500. 500. Yo, what is going on squad? This is Yami Blood and this is our legacy. Guys, 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 before we get into this insanity, just to let you know that I have finally set up members on the channel, which means you guys can join and become certified members of the squad. You'll also get some cool Yu-Gi-Oh perks and will be directly supporting your boy and the channel. So become a member now so that we can continue growing and so that we can continue making all of this insane content. Now then boys, yesterday was an insanely insane, insane in the brain kind of stream. We absolutely demolished the likes of Shiranui, Karakuri, Dragoonity and many more. They all said Burn was dead, they all said Burn was nerfed, they all said that Lava Golem was no longer viable, that even the Shadow Game skill was no longer enough to fight the meta head on, but your boy Yami Blood pulled through. This deck is insane and works like a charm. Man, go watch the live stream, boys. Like, legit, go watch this madness. I'll link the stream in the description. This deck not only works using a burn engine, we can also lock down our opponent's monster zones, and most of today's meta has no out to cards like Vassal that special summon a token to the opponent's side of the field. Anyways guys, enjoy these intense clips, support your boy Yami Blood by smashing that thumbs up button, subscribe if you haven't already, you can now join the channel as a certified member, so go ahead and hit that join button now, notification bells on to never miss any of my streams and or videos, and may the heart of the cards guide you, my boys. Peace out. Ooh, Dragoonity. Troublesome. Troublesome because Ascalon can vanish. We may have to stall until we get the Lava Golem. Hmm. But hold up. Ascalon can't get rid of back row. It's just monsters. So technically we could Mask of the Accursed. Interesting. But I believe um, Dragoonity do run back row removal. So it could be troublesome. I can smell a cosmic somewhere. This man really believes in the heart of the card. I, I don't know what he believes, man. I literally don't know. Okay, let's read Ascalon because... We have to do this properly. You can banish one Dragoonity monster from your graveyard, then target one monster your opponent controls, banish it. If this Synchro Summon card is in its owner's control, it's destroyed by an opponent's card effect. Or card. Alright, so you can't get rid of back row. So I think we just set the Canadia. Set the Floodgate. You can banish Window though, that's the problem. I wonder if I should just Mask of the Accursed. Let's do it. We'll bait his back row anyway. But surely he'll want to get rid of the Accursed. I don't think he would, uh, yeah. You know what? Fiendish Chain, boys. Another good card for this deck. Fiendish Chain. If you don't have the Canadians and Floodgates, go for the Fiendish Chain. Only because it stops the monster effect and it stops from attacking. He wants to battle? This guy, this guy wants to battle? Oh, okay. Guys, I think it's going to be dangerous for this boy. Serious. 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 He's going to need Cosmic Cyclone, so I'm hoping he doesn't have it. It could be um, Hey Trunade or Galaxy Cyclone 2. 
Aaron, thank you for the kind words, man. I'm glad you enjoy the streams. Ah, there we go. There's the Cosmic Cyclone. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. No problems. He's dropping his LP anyway. Time to battle. Canadia. So we Canadia and then Floodgate him. We do have another Floodgate in the hand, so... So we're doing alright. We do have Kite Raid as well. And we've got another Canadian. Guys, I think we've got a pretty, pretty decent board here. I don't even want to set Winder. So we floodgate Ascalon. Okay, okay. He's going to go for it now. He's going to go for it now. He's probably searching for that. Um, well, actually, he might even go for a Cosmic Cyclone right now. Yeah. Night Beam. Dang it. Get the Canadian. Okay. Nice. Nice. We'll activate the floodgate and then summon the Canadian. Nice. And you know what? I might allow him to do his uh, Dragoonity play. So that if he does summon another Ascalon, we floodgate. Or we can stop him now. This card gains 200 attack. When this card is normal, you can select one level through a lord. And equip it to this card. I think let him do his thing. Or nah. He can't really do much, right? Cannot be used. This card can't really commit to him. Special summon. Okay. He's just going for the... The bar chart, right? Ooh, okay. Okay. I know exactly what to do. But first, I think, take this damage. I think we'll attack Couscous. Just to deal some more damage. Oh, and we got Mask. I think we got this, boys. We'll summon Winda. You know what? We could also attack into um, Ducks. And bring out one of the Ritual Beasts. Shall we do that? Shall we do that? Shall we do it? There's a fair few things we can do here. I think uh, attack into ducks. So we attack into ducks. Unless he's got a Karibo. He does have a Karibo. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. 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 Damn, but you know what, guys? Well, he can't use Cosmic Cyclone, but he may have a Night Beam. So I think we need to use that Floodgate ASAP. Because now Shadow Games won't work. He can't drop any more LP. And there is a chance he still has back row removal. Okay. Dang him. Did we just floodgate the Barcher? Well, I mean, if he had a... Uh... Yeah, I think floodgate, man. Don't waste time. Don't waste time. You see, this is where Shadow Games is a problem because... Now we have no way to drop his LP unless we go into a Lava Golem. But going into a Lava Golem is only 500 damage. So it's a bit of a, a problem here. Bit of a problem. He had that Karibo to save him. Uh, trying to think. Trying to think. Who's closer to decking out? I guess he is. I mean, he's got double floodgated monsters. Does he have an out to this? We've got Canadia, double Kyroid. So guys, we've got a couple of things we can do, right? We can either summon the Golem, but we have to bear in mind that it will only drop 500 LP. So it will kind of mess us up. Hmm. But we do have plenty of defense. And he is closer to decking out. So Goblin Thief at this point could be uh Oh, we can just vassal him now. We could actually just vassal him and lock him down completely. I'm kind of worried about um, 
the amount of cards we both have in the deck left. Is there a way he could uh, add a card back to his deck? See, even if we do draw into Lava Golem, I think it's risky for us to summon him. Only because of that 500 issue. Okay. Alright, I don't know why. I think he wants to attack. Actually, you know what? I should have let him thin his deck more. Mm. Okay, we got Golem. Interesting. We do have Golem. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I think I got it. I think I got it. When he puts um this boy, what's his name? Sonatus. When he puts that into attack, if he's going for the attack on Canadia, we'll just summon the next window, go into a Ritual Beast, and then just attack for game. If he's going for the attack, or if he's going to thin his deck, then he's closer to decking out. Yeah, I don't know what my take is on... Okay, he's going to do that. Cool, cool, cool. That's actually fine. Now we can summon the other window from the hand, go into that Ritual Beast summon, and then just smack him for game. Hold up. What is that? 2600? So that's game, right? 200, 800. Ooh, that's still not game. What the? That's still not game? Hmm. I think I want to attack, though. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. We can just attack him with this and then Lava Golem to finish him off. Or we could just deck him out, but I'd rather do something instead of deck out. Unaffected, my bro. Unaffected. You should know this by now. Apelio is unaffected. <laughs> yeah, yeah, don't worry, guys. I'm going to use Golem to end the game. Don't worry. I just hope it's not going to... Oh, some problems for us, though. It'll be nice. Nostalgia. We're going up against a strong Dragoonity deck, like... You know... Let's see. Has he got a back row? Ooh, tribute summon. Okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. I guess we just use Apelia's effect and bring back Winder, double Winder. When he targets it. When Ascalon targets, if he's bringing out Ascalon, can he bring out Ascalon? That's what, 8 starred? Ten stud. Here comes the boy. Interesting. Interesting. I feel like we're cool. We're cool. There's no need to worry. There's no need to sweat it. I don't think anyway. Okay. Look, we got plenty of defense. We're okay. He's got two monsters out. As soon as he's done doing whatever he's doing, we can go into Lava Golem and hopefully get that win. <laughs> Alex, he's going to scoop when the tribute symbol... Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Cool. Alright boys, what a nice way to start the stream man, we're about to summon the boy, we're about to summon the boy, but not only summon the boy, we're about to win with the summon of Lava Golem, 
old school nostalgia to the max to the max tribute tribute summon let's go boys let's go let's go let's go that's how we do boys anti-meta style yeah is he gonna scoop let's see yeah <laughs> yeah scooped sure knew he's a hit Let's go the accursed, so we set the window, set the floodgate. We do not mask. Guys, you know what? I want to literally lock down this guy's monster zone. It's a shame we we opened with not a decent hand. But literally, let him summon his tuner. We floodgate it. But then Gazuki can still send to the grave from the deck. Tribute to the Doom Skis. This guy lost the plot. This guy lost the plot. I don't think so, my bro. I don't think it's happening yet. Go on, Gazook. Go for it, mate. Go for it. Go for it. We just need another floodgate, boys. And then we literally, 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 literally. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Can I bring out Apelio? Yeah, or nay. 2600. If we get a floodgate now, literally, I want to stop this uh, monster zone. Oh. Mask of the Accursed. Well, I guess, I guess, we attack into Gazuki. He will banish Spirit Master, but it won't affect Apelio, so I think we should be fine. But, like, there is a good chance that he goes into a... But, if anything, he can summon this, so that's a six-star synchro already. So either way, we're in a bit of a pickle. Unless we Lava Golem and a Curse. So we can either Lava Golem and a Curse. We Lava Golem and a Curse. If this card is sent to the graveyard, you can banish one zombie type monster from your graveyard. Especially summon one zombie from your hand. So he will destroy Apelia. Ah, I don't know, man. I don't know. Something tells me to Lava Golem. If we go for the attack... I don't know man, I don't know. Baffled here, baffled. Still don't have a good defense. Let's see what he does. I hope he uh, tries to banish Spirit Master. The Apelio shouldn't be affected. Nice. I don't think it should be affected. But see, you can still go into that 6 star, can't you? If this card is in your graveyard, you can target one non tuner Zombie type monster in your graveyard, banish both it and this card. Bringing out that, um... This card will do. There we go. I guess, um... Petal Finn was the... The better way. But now I guess we Lava Golem him? Give me a Floodgate. Thank you! Whoa! Okay. Okay, let's not get too excited just yet. Oof. Just give me that monster lock. 
Come on. Cut scene for luck. Give me the monster lock. As long as he doesn't have back row removal. But you know what? Let's put double a curse on it, man. Let's go all in. It is Shirinui after all. Alright, let's think about this for a moment. So, Lava Golem is out. We a curse. Number one. That set card is floodgated, so we're cool. So we curse number one. I said we go in for a curse number two just in case he does have Cosmic Cyclone. Because when he summons a monster, we will floodgate. We will floodgate this guy. Come on, come on. Ballista could spoil it. Let's see. Let's see. Summon it, bro. Summon it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is there even a point? Just do it. Just do it. Don't think, dude. Mmm. Mmm. Ooh. Does Tribute to the Doom destroy one monster on the field? So it's possible that he could destroy Lava Golem. Let's throw. I guess we set the Mithra. Oh wait, we got game if I summon double lava golem. We got game, right? Yeah, yeah, we got game. That's 500, 500,000. Ooh. Ooh. Shiranui. Getting handed. Come on, come on. And Vassal. Monster locked down. The zone is locked. It's locked, bro. It's locked. Double Lava Golem. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. 500. 500. Let's go, Shirinui. 